What the narcissist does when realizing they're not in control anymore. Narcissists believe they are the greatest creation of all time. They are superior in every way. They know more, are stronger, have more resources, have more charisma, and have greater success. Yes, at times they play the victim role. Just a gimmick to get folks interested. They actively seek adulation. They put on an air of modesty in the hopes that you would see their true greatness. No matter what, you need to worry about becoming their fuel. They have to keep themselves preoccupied so they don't dwell on the anguish, hopelessness, and depression that are already there, banging on the door of their minds. A thought process inside narcissists' heads informs them they are not who they claim to be and that they are, in fact, liars. They should avoid the source of that sound at all costs. What if it turns out to be the case? They simply won't hear us out. They venture out into the world to prove their worth to you and to themselves. Then what happens if they are not able to exert their will over you and your surroundings? From here on out, things will become quite unpleasant. First thing first, I'd like to start by asking you to help this channel expand by sharing this video with your loved ones. Moreover, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to our channel and turn on the bell to receive alerts whenever a new video is posted. Okay, let's continue. To begin with, their actions are sloppy. They'll pretend at first that they don't get what you're saying, so you'll think they're hard to trick. This person just doesn't get why you're so upset with them or what they did to deserve your ire. If you challenge their authenticity or motives, they will act confused and defensive. The magnitude of the problem, as well as the consequences of their terrible choices and actions, are lost on them. The point is that they will have to take action in order to play the victim role. They make fools of themselves in order to avoid dealing with the underlying issue. 2. They will claim you have wronged or offended them in some way. Narcissists believe you've wronged them when you stop letting them dictate your perception of them and the world. By not supporting them monetarily or emotionally, you can show them they no longer have influence over you. You can count on them to always appear as if they are innocent and misunderstood, no matter how horrible their conduct may have been. They commonly say things like, no, that's not what I said. You can bet on hearing, no, I didn't, again and over again. Why are you acting like this, and what have I done to make you so angry? You don't know who I am, he responded. You are, as the saying goes, simply too sensitive. They fabricate tales in which you play the villain so that you'll feel horrible for them. Third, they will rally support for those who disagree with you. When narcissists are unable to alter people's opinions of them, they often attempt to shape those opinions themselves. Narcissists are sneaky and do this behind your back. Do not undervalue a person's narcissistic characteristics, as they will do everything in their ability to poison the feelings of others around them toward you. They have, without a doubt, been trying to undermine people's trust in the system for some time. Don't be shocked if a kid you've always been polite to suddenly turns to mean or if a stranger stares at you oddly for no apparent reason. The narcissist has probably spread a lot of lies about you to those people. If you were to expose them for who and what they really are, it would be a huge blow to their fragile ego. Therefore, they would spend years trying to make it look like you were just like them. 4. Fury, Vengeance, and Narcissist Rage When a narcissist discovers they can't control you, they'll stop at nothing to damage your self-esteem and destroy your perception of them. For the sake of causing trouble, they won't stop at anything. As much suffering as they can bring about will be their goal while they are still in the picture. Narcissists are rarely the ones to leave a relationship or friendship with dignity and class. Disputes and animosity are almost inevitable. I can tell you with absolute certainty that they are trying to frame you as the cause of all of this tragedy and turmoil. The volume of public criticism and ranting will be pushed up to level 11. It takes a lot of guts to see the world the way you do to take off that mask. Their actions must be recognized for what they really are. You've got a lot of nerve to do it. Don't you see that the narcissist probably has an exaggerated opinion of himself? And you have the nerve to establish reasonable standards, constraints, and restrictions. To be honest, I admire your bravery in escaping from such a toxic environment. You deserve a pat on the back. Then, narcissists will move on to your social media profiles. 
No matter how blatant or subtle their narcissistic tendencies are, you can tell if someone lacks emotional maturity when they refuse to do anything real, sensible, loving, or kind to help solve the problem. They won't sit down with you and try to figure out a solution. Instead, they'll score your social network for their next move. They are constantly on the lookout for new techniques to use your data against you. 5. They'd be offering bogus explanations. Narcissists are unable to feel what it feels like to be in another person's shoes. They have no concept of good and wrong and have no ethics. They seem to carry an inflated sense of entitlement into every aspect of their lives. They believe that they have the freedom to conduct their daily lives as they see fit. This should serve as a warning to you. Do not fall for any tricks. To them, it's of little importance that they cause you harm. They regret their attitude, choices, and actions, but they feel horrible about what they did. Do not be fooled by someone else's fake apology. The shifts you're feeling will gradually disappear over time. Once you've earned their favor again, you may anticipate them to resort to their old ways of doing things. If you refuse to give in to the narcissist's lies and manipulations, they will eventually find someone else to use. They have to find a more readily exploitable supply of narcissism. The news is bad for the new target, but fantastic for you. Fortunately, you won't have to worry about any of that. It may take a while, but you shouldn't give up. It's not going to be easy, but you know that the work is always worth it in the end. That's all I've got to say, but keep in mind that there's still a lot of ground to cover. That wraps up today's video, so I guess we're done here. Please help us out by clicking the like button and spreading the word if you found this video helpful. If you liked this video and want to see more like this, please subscribe to our channel and turn on the bell notification. As always, thank you for watching and taking the time to listen.